What's up, everyone, and welcome back to some more Dota Underlords. Uh, still rank uh, boss one. Haven't really made any progress in that area, but we're trying out. <clears throat> uh, Medusa did get nerfed, but I don't know. I'm going to go Axe. Now, normally I would buy a Drow here and just try and get Hunters because Hunters are still like a solid choice always. Um, but I feel like they're very highly contested as well. So... I don't know. Um, some other... Some things did get buffed, so... <clears throat> I might be trying to go for those. I don't know. Maybe we'll try something I've never, ever, ever done before. Which is like four brawny units and... Warrior, Hunter, Warrior... Shaman. Hmm, four, your brawny, four brawny units and something else. I don't know. Tranquil Boots. Sure. They're pretty good. Put those on our tank. Our tank lives longer. Our DPS gets the hit more. Very good. Very good. Now I am uploading a video right now, so it might lag a little bit as I'm playing. Well, there's another axe. I can get behind that if the lag would kick in. Uh, ooh, you can actually... Nice. So they added a little question mark you could click to bring up the uh, the stats. That's very nice. I was I was hoping they would add that. Um, okay, well, I guess we just add two axes here. I don't want to buy the ogre because I would have to lock and I'm not really fond of locking. Let's just buy the bats and call it good. Maybe we can go into trolls or something. Oh, what else did they do? They did something. Um, I don't remember all of it, actually. Maybe it was the item select screen I'm thinking of. They changed something with the item select screen. Oh, no, 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 no. They had, let's see, level. Here we go. Uh, Brawny units start the round with 50 max health for every unit they have killed. Yes! Uh-oh. Okay, there we go. I was like, I'm going to be lagging. I don't usually lag this bad when whenever I'm uploading and recording, but I guess sometimes I do. So, I mean, I've got the Forged in Battle, so Brawny is going to be the name of the game. And so we just need something to do damage in the back line, potentially. Well, maybe we go into Trolls. I mean, it's kind of giving us Trolls, and Troll Warlord can do quite a bit of DPS. We could be really annoying and go, like, uh, Druid and, like, other healing units as well. Maybe just try and heal everything up, but I feel like that would just be dumb. We need damage. So this Forged in Battle essentially ensures us that we get a strong front line. As long as we get Brawny units. I mean, obviously, we have to get the units in order for it to work. But I don't see... This guy's got an axe, but I'm already nearly at a tier 2 axe. So, yeah, nobody else... I mean, this guy's got one too, but nobody else really has axes. So I think I'll be fine. Um, let's just go for Smuggler. Smuggler's all right. Normally, I, I like to get items. I think items are a bit stronger than the sort of the passive effects, but it's all right. Well, there's our axe, and there's a Beastmaster and a Juggernaut. Um, okay, what do we sell here? Well, ooh. We sell something. All right, I'm selling Shadow Shaman for the Juggernaut. We're putting these guys in. Three brawny units. The reason I want the brawny in is because of Forged in Battle. Now, this doesn't count for neutrals, I don't think. Let's see. So he has eight kills. He has 2,000 health. Is that normal? Um, I don't think they get bonus health for neutral kills. So... The eight kills were from the neutrals. Is he getting? I don't know what a uh, tier two axe's uh, health pool is, so I don't know if it starts off at two thousand. But I think I remember testing previously, and that they didn't actually get. Uh, maybe that was a bug, though. I don't know. They've been changing a lot of things. Oh wait, he's at fourteen hundred. Okay, so it does. Yeah, he was getting uh, bonus health from the neutrals. That's really nice. Well. I think I have to stick more of these guys in because they stack. So this this Juggernaut's kill count and this Juggernaut's kill count, when I stack them, will get combined together for the uh, Forged in Battle bonus. So I definitely want to get all those guys out. I 
I think a third warrior would probably be smart. Just because I already have two. So maybe a pudge for the heartless. Let's look at our other warriors here. The earlier battles don't really matter too much. And they're not that entertaining anyway. Um, oh, Troll Warlord could be our third warrior, though. Mm. If we're going like trolls, but we, I don't want to, I don't want to set myself into the notion of trolls right now. Go okay, look, we didn't even have to level this round, and we're winning. Um, yeah, I don't want to like, I don't want to dedicate to trolls right now because I've only got two. I had to sell one just to be able to get the uh, the brawny units, but I suppose we could buy this just because why not? Then we'll probably just sell it after the the round starts. Well, there's another nature's prophet, but no, I'm not. Let's see, we buy you. I think I'm just gonna get rid of you. Oh, good. Um, so we buy the Luna. Luna would definitely give us some Knight damage. Silver's finest at your command. Best not leave me on the sidelines. Um. We're going to need another Warlock. Well, we don't need, but it's going to be good to have another Warlock. So I'm thinking for that, I'll probably go um, Necrophos. That'll give me another Heartless. So potentially we can get a Heartless bonus going on. I don't know. We'll see. Let's not let's not focus on that too much. Right now, let's focus on the Brawny units. So we're trying to get the Brawny, brawny up. Triple Warrior would be nice. Um, we got a... Racking up the kills on these guys, so yeah, it's going good. Then we've got some trolls we could potentially go into. Maybe a Luna for damages, I don't know. I wonder if it'd be smart to level up here. I do have a win streak going. Ooh, well. All right, if I'm gonna dip under anyway, I'm just gonna level up, we'll swap the Luna in. And then we're buying no, all this I'm stuff like anyway, right? So. So we've got some trolls. Um, yeah, if anything, I, s I sell the axe because we already have a tier two axe. So we've potentially got some trolls going on. Maybe a Luna as well. Hmm. Well, Luna's not gonna get much done here, is she? Maybe I should have thrown in the Pudge for the warrior bonus. I don't think they get credit if they die, so any kills that happen after these guys die, they're not going to get credit for. And it's kind of important that I, you know, get as many kills as I possibly can. Uh, maybe leveling up there wasn't the play, because it didn't really matter. I suppose Luna was probably the wrong choice to put in. I don't know, I, I, if she was able to attack, you know, it would have been different. Well, there's another Shadow Shaman. There's an Arc Warden. Arc Warden's kind of garbage. I don't. Okay, I'm just gonna sell the axe, and gosh, I wish I could get up to ten. I'm gonna put the pudge in instead of the Luna. Now I do have like just all tank, but we do have Juggernaut damage, I guess. So it's not all bad. How much HP are you up to? Not really too much. You've gained what three kills? I mean, we're tanky, but people are dying before I'm getting the kills, so. Uh, yeah, we just have no damage. Wait, is that guy going demons? I didn't see if he had an AM. Whatever. Let's buy the Shadow Shaman. Uh, yeah, I feel like I need something just to do damage right now. If I'm not getting kills on the brawny units, it's kind of pointless to have them in. Okay, there's an upgraded Luna. Well, light gives me purpose. Yeah, we're gonna do this. All right, so let's take out a Juggernaut and let's put in a, a tier two Luna here by the ax. I mean, we're pretty, we're going pretty good on trolls as well. So this setup with four trolls would give me eight units. And then I could throw a Necrophis in for a, a Warlock Heartless. And yeah, I don't know. One more unit could be... Well, I do have one more Brawny I could buy as well. So yeah, we're gonna be looking for that Brawny for sure. 
I could have leveled as well, but I'm not on a win streak anymore, so it's okay. Although maybe I should have. I do want to start building up some interest. I feel like I got a lot of units early, which is great, but at the same time, it's going to delay my uh, my economy, which is kind of bad. So I think I, I don't know though. Like it's also important to get kills on the Brawny. You know what? We're going to scale up. We're going to scale. So I, I feel like I can delay my eco a little bit more. That's a Necrophos. That's a very early Necrophos. So I am definitely leveling up and buying the Necrophos and sticking him in. So that's going to give me a Heartless bonus. We don't have the Warlock bonus yet. That'll come when we put in the, the other troll dude, if we do. So let's see, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wait. Two, three, four, five, six, huh. Yeah, if we went for troll, we wouldn't be able to go... Wait. We wouldn't be able to go for Brawny. If I went for troll, I wouldn't be able to go for Brawny. Hmm. Should I just not even warn? I mean, that's, that's 300 HP on potentially four people. Yeah, well, yes, four people, because I'm going to have four brownies. One go when you lose a fight. Interesting. Huh. I think I'm going to go for that. Just in case my plan backfires on me. I'm not going to buy Pudge right now. Luna's kind of tempting. I wish I could really just sell something. He's only worth one. Uh, I could sell the Witch Doctor. And maybe just not go into Trolls. Alright, let's do that. and Let's get up to 10. So let's start getting some Eco going here. Potentially. Maybe I don't go Trolls. Maybe I don't go Trolls. Um... I feel like my Juggernaut's not really going to get a lot of kills. Well, that was just three right there. Four, five. Well, I don't know if it counts. I think he has to actually do damage to him for it to count, so that probably didn't count. But man, our, our people are getting pretty beefy. I wish it told me how many stacks I had. I guess it does, huh? Kill count. But though, does it count neutrals in the kill count? Maybe not. I guess we can buy the Pudge. Probably just going to sell it right afterwards, but... Yeah, I'm holding on to these trolls still, but... I don't know, it would... Like, four troll would be really good with this build, I feel like. Because it would give the Luna a lot of attack speed. Um, we didn't get anything here. Do I just... I guess I just sit and do nothing here, which kind of feels bad. But I don't know, we could level up again next turn and throw in... We don't even have anything great to throw in because we sold our Witch Doctor. If I had the Witch Doctor, I could throw that in for a Warlock bonus. Huh. Well... Do we level up next turn? It's gonna be, what, 15 gold? Yeah. It'll cost me 15 gold to level up. It'll be like my entire freaking savings here. I don't think I can level up. But again, like, winning with the brawnies is kind of important. To continue to pump up their health. Like, if I want to scale... I mean, I could ditch the trolls and just say, nope, no troll. That would give me four. Hmm. I don't know. Yeah, I don't really know what to go here. Um, well, we're above 20, so we definitely stay there, probably. Oh, wait, I'm on a win streak. Is putting in another unit really going to help me, though? I don't think it's going to help me that much. Nobody else leveled anyway, so... Yeah, 
if I had a tier 2 unit or something, then I'd be more inclined to level up and put that in to try and keep that. Wait, not posting it as heal off? That's a real feels bad, man. Go, Juggernaut, go! We need Juggernaut to get a lot of stacks. Same with the uh, Beastmaster. Beastmaster can pump out a lot of damage if he lives for a long time. I've never actually got forged in battle that early with like brawny units, so this could be pretty nice. Um, give me something good, game. We're up to 20. We kept our win streak going, which is kind of nice. Um, that's not at all what I want. Do we just sell the pudge? Gosh, dude. Um, I feel like selling the trolls is the right move and just saying no troll, but troll would be so good with this. Like Luna is going to be our primary damage. We don't know what's coming. Um, so we need like attack speed on her. Mass of Madness, I guess, could be that. Maybe we just go for some other form of damage. I mean, it's not like the trolls themselves don't do damage. Where did we have to? 2200 on Axe. 1200 on this guy, 1400 on this guy. Remember, these are only tier 1s. Maybe I, I leveling up and putting the second tier 1 Juggernaut in would be pretty good, because then he could get more kills, and then once I actually did combine them, they would stack up and his, his HP would be amazing. Next round's neutrals, so I can continue to save. I don't really have to worry about that. Am I going to win this? Beastmaster axes, yeah. Wait, is this one tree ain't going to kill me? No. Okay. Way to go. You're the you're the sole survivor, tier one beastmaster. Okay, I'm on a five round win streak. Now I'm tempted to just spend. Well, this is neutral round. Even if you lose a neutral round, it doesn't break your streak. So I'm not gonna bother leveling up here. Um, I didn't get anything. Still, is it gonna be one of those scenarios where I have like this amazing start and then I just don't get any of my units for the rest of the game? If, I feel like that happens to me a lot. It's not as if people are actually... Well, this guy's got a single Luna. There are a couple Bat Riders on the field. But I don't know. Oh crap, I forgot about this round. I wonder if my Brawny units can actually tank it up and carry me through. So let's see, he's up to 1400. He's got 12 kill count here. Let's see if his kill count goes up. If, if they would actually kill something. I see his kill count did not increase. So I, I don't think neutrals count towards the uh, the brawny kill count bonus for this. Units and shop offer if you are one level higher. Uh, I think Octarine Essence is probably actually better. And on the Beastmaster. Beastmaster axes do a lot of damage. But again, I do have to level them up. I have to, okay, that's, that's two more axes. I mean, how do I not buy this? We sell the pudge. And then we do that. Do we put this in instead of the juggernaut? Axe is actually doing more damage than the juggernaut. But I don't know. I feel like having the juggernaut in for the, uh, the kill stacks here would probably be better. Whoa, wait. How did he die so quick? My axe died very quickly. I guess he was getting focused by everything. All right, Luna. Stop stunning my Luna, you. Oh my God. <laughs> what is this stun ability, dude? The cooldown on this is so low, holy cow. Well, there goes my streak. I guess I should have leveled up, huh? Or maybe not taken out the Juggernaut. I'm gonna put the Juggernaut back in. <laughs> I have a tier two axe, but Juggernaut's probably better. Yeah, no. Pudge, stop tempting me. Um, okay, well, we gotta go Beastmaster, and then we definitely level up here. But what do we stick in as a thing? I feel like a Shadow Shaman could be good, but I wanna get more, um, more brawny stacks, so I'm gonna put in the other guy. Oh, I actually dipped under 50. Okay, I'm gonna sell him. I'm not sure that troll is in the is in the works 
or troll is going to be possible, even though there's like nobody going troll. So let's think about what else we can do. We could go Naga for Naga. For Bonnie, for Naga. Uh, one Luna. Well, what about our locks? Yeah, we have the Necrophos here. I mean, we don't have to keep him. You didn't get any stacks. Maybe it's not even worth having this guy in because he's not getting any stacks anyway. Well, there's another Witch Doctor. Suppose maybe we put you in for the, the healing bonus or the Warlock bonus here. And then... Well, if I want to go Naga, I mean, I guess I can buy him. Yeah, I might just have to give up on the on the Dream of Trolls, which I think I am. Goodbye. Goodbye, we'll Luna. And brave. Four lock. Hmm. I go four lock. Are we could? Nah. I was gonna say we could go knights, but I think our front line is pretty solid. Maybe. I say that, but they're not really getting kills anymore because I haven't gotten many upgrades. Oh, there's another Witch Doctor. <sighs> Alright. Maybe I will go Troll, even though I just sold my entire Troll pack. Finally, Juggernaut upgrade. Thank you. I don't bother with Drow. We could go four lock. I have to decide now. Do I want to go four lock or do I want to go Naga? Um, shoot, I should probably roll, but hold on. I think Naga would probably be better. Do I just go two Naga though? Mm. Or eight. I mean, I could. Yeah, I don't. I can't do four lock two Naga. I don't know. The knights are kind of wrecking me. Maybe I just go more heartless, since everything I do is pretty much just right clicks on my brawnies. More heartless might be good. I'm gonna go ahead and buy the. Well, you know, what? I'm not gonna buy the Vinos. Vinos suck anyway. If I do go more warlocks, I don't want Vino, even though it's given me a lot of them. I don't have any Savage or anything, so I, I don't want this guy. Let's see, well, there's another Axe. So since we've already got two tier twos, we pick him up for sure. Okay. Witch Doctor. Um, do I buy the Shadow Shaman? Sure, I guess. Oh, there's another one. Maybe we are going back into Trolls. Here we go. Back in the back and forth. Well, there was another. Oh, oh, it's a neutral round. Okay, never mind. Um, Medusa. We do have one hunter. We could go three hunter and get double, double scaled that way. I'm gonna pick her up. Although we could do the same thing with Tide, right? Well, we could go Dusa Tide, but that's kind of like that's stretching it because we don't want to wait that long. Uh, opponent's healing is reduced by yes, so we want to reduce their healing by 50% right now. Maybe I do go heartless now. Is anybody going like big heals? There's a, some druids, druids heal, but uh, that guy might have some warlock. I think I just go heartless, maybe. Um, do I level up here? Let's see. Cost me 25. I don't think I want to. If anything, I level up. I wait till next round to level up. I'm trying to think, like, how can I boost my Luna's damage? Trolls would be a great source of damage for that, but. Like. 
so these guys are becoming very tanky, right? So should I just increase their tankiness by going for Naga? I kind of want to do that. Or scaled, scaled, or scaled. Um, jeez, I don't know. I don't know. Should I? I mean, there's no guarantee that I even do that, but... Okay, let's level. I should have maybe waited to level, but I'll go ahead and put the Deuce in here. We could pick up another Hunter. I suppose Tide Hunter would accomplish that. Okay, I'm going to say no to the Slardar. If we do do double scale, it'll be a Tide Hunter. Oh, they're invisible. I was like, wait, what's happening? Okay, Deuce got her ult off, which is nice. Doing pretty well with what we got right now. Maybe I should just continue to go Heartless. Oh, that's right. I took the Heartless bonus, so I don't necessarily want to lose those. Drow would, Drow would increase the damage of Luna, but eh. We could go Abaddon, Drow, or Abaddon Lich. Because we do have one Knight, so the Abaddon wouldn't be wasted. I've, it's sad because I've passed a couple Abaddons already. Um, we haven't gotten a disruptor yet, so our fourth brawny unit might not happen. I mean, if I see it, I'll probably pick it up, but yeah. It's, well, there's another troll. Okay, I think trolls are out at this point. I'm just gonna, I'm, I'm, I'm calling it. No more trolls. Stop trolling me. Well, there's a juggernaut. I suppose it's worth picking him up. Um,. No, um, Slark's actually pretty good, but no. There's another Juggernaut. So I've got a lot of things that are actually coming close to tier 3 here. Oh, there's a Luna. There's a Troll Warlord. Okay. I'm going to say yes to the Troll Warlord. Re reason being, I already have a tier 2 Troll in there in the form of Witch Doctor, and he's going to synergize with the Warriors a little bit. So, yeah. Blessings you, you. And Troll will offer me a little bit of damage. Now I'm very tempted to go Drow. I am very tempted to go Drow now. I think I will. If I can. I mean, there's no guarantee. I'm on a win streak as well. I'd like to keep that going. So do we take out the Medusa? Hold on. Medusa did very little damage. I think we put in the, uh, the Troll, honestly. It'll give me the Troll bonus. So let's see, hold on. So I'm going these four, these four, Drow, five. So I've got eight right now. Drow, five, Tidehunter, six. Do I even, uh, well, I can't go four, four Heartless. All right, so Alchemist is not a pickup then. Wait, Drow, uh, Maybe I don't go Drow. We go Medusa Tide. Because we won't have the scale bonus with Drow. This Slark is going ham though. Yeah, Slark does a lot of damage. Okay, um... Yeah, let's roll past that. Oh, hello Medusas. I think that goes in instead of the... Troll here. She could actually be on the front line. She could, she could be like somewhere here. So she's got 1700 HP um, and 5 armor. So it's, you know, Juggernaut's got 1200 and 5 armor. So she's tankier than Juggernaut. Well, one more axe and we'll have a tier 3. I don't think we can go for a tier 3 Beastmaster right now. Although it would be very, very nice to do so. I think I save for level up. It would put me at 25 if I leveled up right now, but it's neutral round, so we'll just hang on right now. And see. I mean, I could go Warrior too. No, 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 no. We're 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 doing we're going into uh, double scaled, so Tide Hunter is going to be a thing. <clears throat> yeah. So I've currently got eight on the uh, eight on the field. So I've got room for two. One of them will be a Tide Hunter for the scaled bonus. So I'll have room for one more. 
which will be the troll warlord probably. Maelstrom. Uh, how fast do you attack? Probably best on the Medusa. Maybe I want to move her back now, honestly, but I didn't. We'll watch and see how she does. If she dies like right away, then I'll have to move her. I mean, I do have a win streak, so it's kind of risky, but let's see, 68 minus 34. So I'd be at 33 if I leveled up right now, but I would keep the win streak going. I think I'm gonna do so. Put in the tier two Luna over the troll probably is smart. Yeah, tier one troll is not gonna offer me too much, I don't think. Double Luna. Okay, well, Medusa got doomed, so she's not going to get her ult off anyway, but she lived a very long time. Having her right in the middle of all our tanks makes it pretty hard for her to get focused, I think. But it kind of sucks that she got doomed. I mean, she would have got doomed anyway, probably. Maybe I should stick the Maelstrom on somebody else, but she has the fastest attack, so she, like, she's going to have a better chance of getting procs than any of these other guys. I could always get rid of the pug for the drow. But I don't know, it might be, it's probably too late to be thinking about getting drows right now. Uh, that's Necrophos. We'll buy after the round starts so we get our interest. Yeah, it, it's, I think it's, we're level nine. It's too late to be, to have a chance of getting drows, as you can see. Um, so they added this if you hover over your level it shows you the chance of getting the tier units so tier one units i have a 22 percent chance of getting well i guess that's not that bad is it i don't know we'll see we'll see what we get let's see what we get we got to focus on what we got now so i mean another axe would be nice we're kind of just stomping we're on a huge win streak here did i just save up hold on I would need 45 gold to level up to 10. If I can keep my win streak going for two more rounds. Oh well, wait, this is going to be three. One more round would put me at. Eh, that's. I think we wait till till eight. Or till we have eight uh, experience to level up. So that would be. Yeah, that would be 40 gold. So uh, we'll make sure we have 80 gold at that point. Well, there's a freaking drow, but I have no room on my bench. I'll tell you what I'll do. Let's do this. All right. Well, now we have room. Tier three axe, very nice. Oh, we're not above fifty. That sucks. No, yeah, it's okay. A tide hunter would actually be pretty nice. Yeah, because I've got two Lunas on the board. I'm like, wait, I have nine units. So Troll will be our... Well, maybe. I don't know. If we don't get any more Trolls, I might end up swapping him out. But again, if I get... Uh, if I get, like, Drowls, maybe I just... I nix the Pudge. And I throw a Drow in between all my damage dealers. We'll see. So I'm gonna need to save for like four rounds to get to 80. Well, I could, I don't mind dipping down to 40 gold for for level 10. So if I still have my streak going by then, it's probably worth it. So I don't. One thing I don't want to do is level up on an uh, not a multiple of four because I'm gonna spend five gold for like three experience or something. Well, that's a tide troll. Um, so I think I do this, and then instead of the Luna, we put the Tide in. It gives us the scale bonus. It also gives us our third Hunter bonus. Now, one thing I got to worry about is where I'm going to place this guy. I want it to be somewhere where he gets damaged, but not too damaged. A lot of people are centered in the corner, here. so I think that'll be all right. Hopefully. Oh yeah, he should get it off really quick. Oh, I got silenced! 
No. Tide, bro. You're disappointing me. I mean, the scale bonus along with the brawnies is probably just going to carry me here. But still. I mean, the 300 bonus is actually kind of nice, too. But still. Okay, we got two... Yeah, we might just sell the drow and say, forget about it. Forget about it. Let's put him there. Maybe that'll be better, because the Kunkka was right there, right? I mean, he could always get silenced by one of the backline humans, like the Coddle. But you're the one who stole my Disruptor, you son. You son of a gun. Um, do you have any human? No. So it's just this guy with the... Well, not that guy. This guy. This guy with the Kunkka is... Uh, not you. Where'd you go? I Did he die? He may have got knocked out. Oh, is it him? I don't know. Um, okay. 60, 70, 80, 5, 6, 7. So I can roll a little bit here. Maybe we'll just roll once and see where we are. Um, oh, it's neutrals. Okay. Do you, get, do you keep your win streak on neutral rounds? I don't win streak enough to know this, guys. But I guess I'll find out right here. Uh, let's see. So well, this will be six, seven, eight. So two rounds, I'll have to have 80 or maybe more. If I was up to 90, I could stay above 50. But at level 10, I don't. Units are one gold cheaper or a BKB. Retaliates. Um, I'm going to take the, uh, the units are one gold cheaper thing. Cause I'm in a lead and I, I kind of just want to solidify that. I don't think a BKB is going to continue to help me. I think just upgrading my units is going to be much better. Of course, there's always the chance that I never get there, but, you know, <laughs> uh, I think friends and family discount is probably better. It's funny, I took Silver Lining, but I haven't really been losing that much. Go figure. Uh, so this will be 7, so let's see, 70, 80. We'll actually be there. Let's do a couple of rerolls here. Okay, we didn't get anything. Oh, there's a Beastmaster. Alright, Drow. You're gone, I'm sorry. We should work, yeah, starting to work on Tier 3s is probably pretty good right now, because I'm going to be leveling up to 10 pretty soon. So... I don't know if Beastmaster is the best choice for a tier 3, but I've already got two of them, so... Man, our Necrophos is still tier 1. Feels bad, man. Also, if we get Tides, we're not going to have anywhere to stick them. Let's see, if I do get Tides, what do I sell? Probably the Juggernauts. I don't know that a tier 3 Juggernaut is worth pursuing. Um, okay, so next level... We can roll like once or twice. Uh, tier 3 Medusa would be nice. Do I sell for that? Am I more likely to get Medusas? Not really. I'm not more likely to get Medusas than Juggernaut or the other dude. No, a tier 3 Medusa would do more for me than them. So maybe I do that. Maybe I say no to you and you, and I buy the Dusa. Oh, she's tier three. Oh, no, 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 she's not. It's just one gold cheaper because of friends and family discount. Okay. All right, so here we level. Um, we'll hit level 10. We'll stay above 50 gold as well. Just get it up there. I, I want to wait till the very last. Well, I guess it doesn't matter at this point. They don't have any gold to level up. This guy's already hit 10, so I can just... There we go. All right, so we'll level up right here. We'll still be about 50 gold when the round ends. I think we've got this, guys. We've got 81 health, and um, yeah. So Wicked Intent, along with Forged in Battle, worked out pretty well for us. Oh, yeah, that's right. I've got 10. Um, it's probably better to have the Luna than the Troll until we get upgrade on the Troll, which I should be trying for right now. I won't 
Got it. Smooth. Smooth sail in there. Okay. Look at our damages numbers here. Ooh, buddy. Okay, I think we got that one. How are you doing? Uh, you're not fighting me. Wait, were you? Yeah, you were. Oh, you're getting smashed, friends. Let's look at these synergies. So yeah, not like a hard dedication to one thing. Like, maybe when I first started playing, I might have tried to go like all warriors, even with the brawny bonus there. But after like playing a bit, it's just, it's not that good. I mean, if you get a lot of warriors early on and and it's just kind of no other choice than maybe, but I don't know, this seems to work out pretty well. Nice. Okay, let's read by the Juggernaut. Uh, it's a, a Witch Doctor as well. I think this guy's dead next turn, so... Um, I'm not really going to sweat it too much. Oops, keep clicking the uh, question mark thing. Alright, well, we're starting to get some Tier 3s. Wrapping up. I don't think I worry about the uh, Witch Doctor, honestly. If I'm going for tier 3s, it's going to be something that gives me a lot of damage. Oh, my Medusa just, like, murdered. Wait, is this guy going to stop me? Did he pull some shenanigans and move, move his units around? I mean, okay, if I lose here, it doesn't really matter too much. What matters is if he loses. Look at these brawny units. 4,100 health on the axe. 3,100 on the juggernaut. 4,000 on the beastmaster. Uh, you're not a brawny unit. How much damage did Troll do? Wait, this is his. Oh yeah, pretty good damage Troll. Beastmaster with the 6800, those are the whirling, or the axes. Oh, pulled out the wind, baby. Let's go, did I rank up? Oh yeah, boss level two. Boss three, on my way. Anyway, thank you for watching this a video. If you enjoyed it, hit that thumbs up button. Leave me a comment if you have any questions or build suggestions or anything like that. Thank you again, and I hope you all have a wonderful day.